Breaking the wall of sanitation. Qualified in the Zurich lab, Joshua Urieli, Zürcher Hochschule der Künste, Switzerland. One in three people in this world do not have a safe and dignified toilet. Think about that. One in three people start every day using a humiliating, degrading, dirty, shared drop toilet, which pollutes the environment, causing disease, illness, and death. Entrepreneurs in Africa and South America have developed systems based on containers. In these systems, the user has a container toilet in their home, which has plastic containers inside where the waste is collected. These containers are then collected on a weekly basis and taken to a central processing site, where the waste is turned into valuable fertilizers and fuels. Users in Kenya are currently paying six US dollars for this service per month. However, these services are struggling to grow. There are a number of reasons for this. The process of going to the toilet and storing that waste for a week has moved from outside to inside the home, which can cause quite a smell. Furthermore, the emptying of these containers is dangerous and labor intensive, which leads to high costs. At the Uni Zurich University of Arts, we have developed this paper bag that goes directly into existing container toilets, replacing the plastic container inside. Inside this paper bag comes this mushroom additive. This mushroom additive goes into the toilet after each use, bioactively controlling the smell, meaning that the solution can be used for the whole week without any issue. Because the bag and the waste inside is biodegradable, the whole lot can go into the compost without uh, any contact, and without any smell. This mushroom technology has been tested in Kenya, and now we are developing towards um, this bringing this technology to market. This mushroom bag solution is one small innovation on the road to realizing safe and dignified sanitation for three out of, out of three people in this world. Thank you. Questions here? There's an initiative uh, from Sweden, people doing the same thing in Kigali. If you compare it to them, how does it look? Um, so they have just a, a plastic bag without any toilet around it. So you're asking people to crouch and use a plastic bag. And of course, that then smells if you, if you store it, if you don't throw it away. Question here? So the, the dignity is the difference. Cost per week? Cost. So this is... Um, so currently users pay six for the month for the service, and that includes the toilet rental and the weekly collection. So that's six US dollars a month. Thank you very much. Thank you.